Hi guys, it's Yanni. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I wanted to do something like fun, kind of. I wanted to do something like I like a hobby kind of thing. I don't know. Let me just explain it to y'all. So as you guys know, I am 19 years old, and this is my last year as a teen. Like literally, this is the last year with teen at the end of my age like my age next year sounds a little bit serious I don't know but I just want to enjoy now like I just want to really be present and be like in this year and we're already in August almost September so it's supposed to come up in the end y'all know my birthday is in March so I don't have that long to go still a teen and if y'all know me, know my past and everything, y'all, I've been having a ball. Like, life has been so good to me. So many opportunities. So many, like, I'm just in a space where I'm not living, I'm living, like, this magical, some type of, like, dream. Like, you know, like, traveling when I was younger and meeting a whole bunch of friends and being places that people my age shouldn't have been as far as, like, opportunities go. Being in buildings and spaces where it's just like, wow, like, you're really here. Like, you was really able to do this. But the problem is, y'all, is, I'm not going to lie, my memory is kind of bad. I'm not going to lie. So, I wanted to start a scrapbook. I want to scrapbook my last year as a teen. Really, I just want to start a scrapbook in general so I can put, like, these memories and stuff I have, like, from my phone because y'all know how Apple be they be they be losing me a whole lot if y'all know y'all know so I want to be able to have physical pictures like a book where I can like show my kids you know what I'm saying like when I was younger my mom they had like photo albums and I was able to see like her life and everything so I want to make my own photo album scrapbook of my life and my last year as a teen so today we're going to start all of that for you guys I'm actually about to go and get the like materials and stuff for the scrapbook i want it to be cute y'all know i can draw i can paint so we definitely gonna decorate it all nice and cute and everything but i just want this to be like a little like memory thing for me like i don't know my youtube videos are great like that's video proof of this life that i'm living right now but i think pictures are so cute and so important so i don't know because i have so many pictures y'all literally i have almost a hundred thousand pictures in my phone which that's probably why Apple and my phone be tripping sometimes. But anyways, we're going to get those off and get them like in a book or whatever. Uh, so yeah, that's what today's video is going to be about. I want to thank Lainey for sponsoring today's video. They are the ones that's even making this video possible for me. If you guys don't know, Lainey is a photo printer. They sent me over the Lainey 4x6 printer and we're about to open it and get started. Guys, I'm so excited. Like y'all know me. I'm such a like digital camera. I'm such a Polaroid camera type of girl. So to have a printer that I can just easily set up, easily connect to my phone and just get pictures off. Chef's kiss. Okay, so we're about to unbox the Lainey printer. Um, it comes with the paper, the inkless cartilage, which I love that, the charger, um, the pieces itself. This is where the paper goes, and I love it because it has a magnetic top. So the printer itself is small, and then you just stick that right on top. It's just easy. Not for my favorite part, y'all. This is the part that makes the printer completely inkless. This ribbon piece doesn't require any liquid ink, and you don't have to worry about dirty hands or dirty surfaces or ink spills, and it doesn't need an ink replacement. All of it's right here, and it's much more convenient. You put the paper in this little storage compartment that fits perfectly on the top until you're ready to use. And your printer is basically ready. Lenny Photo Printer also has great Wi-Fi and a built-in hotspot. And you can connect up to five devices for the printer. So you don't just have to connect your phone. You connect your computer or your iPad or wherever the most fun pictures are, you can connect it. You can also customize your photos before they're printed in the Lenny app. So there's different templates and different stickers and different photo frames that you can use that will also print when the pictures are printed. So it makes it really cute. And I can't wait for that because y'all know scrapbooks are fun and cute and they have different themes to different pages and I just can't wait I just can't wait the printer also has a four layer lamination that's automatic so your pictures can last up to 100 years the quality y'all is amazing the quality of the photos that are printed are excellent and they have true color rendering so you don't lose any color you don't lose any saturation or any quality once the photos are printed love that as well as being super cute the printer is also dust proof waterproof and fingerprint proof so I can easily set it up right here or on my nightstand don't have to worry about anything. It's going to look cute. I want to give a big shout out to Lainey for sponsoring today's video. 
Okay guys, I'm about to head out to the craft store. I just showed you guys how to set up the printer. I made sure everything was set up. I tested it out for you guys. That baby picture of me is so cute. And it came out so cute, y'all. Y'all see them colors? Very vibrant. Anyway, so it is currently 208 right now. I'm about to head to Michael's. I feel like Michael's, I'll be able to find everything that I need. Um, I want to get like two picture frames. I want to get, of course, the book itself. I need to get some glue or like tape glue, some type of glue. I'm going to look on TikTok University and see like what, like what stuff I need or whatever. So we're about to go right now. I'm so excited, y'all. Like I've never made a scrapbook, but I've seen so many TikToks of people having them and they're just like so cute. So I don't know. I got to figure out like what theme I want. It shouldn't be that far. It's getting really cold outside. Not cold, but like you could feel the season change. And it's just so crazy to me because I never really paid attention to it before. But like coming back from LA, like it's definitely getting colder. It's still really hot, but it's getting colder. I cannot wait to get my car wrapped, y'all. I need to get a car wash. I feel like y'all are really close, but I'm doing a different angle, so just bear with me or whatever. I just can't wait to see how it goes. Like I want it to be so fun and creative. I want to have these books, and I want to do. I should probably like not gonna lie. I think I want to do one for like every year. So I think I'm gonna make this one just this year. But it's kind of like I want a baby picture one and I'm going to just go off of like the photos that I have. Baby pictures. I think I'm going to do like both pages counts as like one page of a Cesarea. We are 17 minutes away so we're not that far away. Come on baby don't Y'all I am so obsessed with my hair like I don't think y'all understand like I love this hairstyle like y'all know I'm, I'm on my curly hair journey trying to get my like this is how I want my hair like I really feel like I'm manifesting and like really envisioning what my hair is going to be like in a couple years because this is what I want it to be like love it like I love this hair make sure I go shop baby doll's link I feel like I really eat up every hairstyle like every hairstyle that I get I feel like works for me it's giving 10 out of 10 every time every single time literally every single time we the best and I told you this back in 05. Okay guys, so I just made it here. I was so scared because I don't know if you guys can see. There's a Michaels back there. And that's the one I... <coughs> That's when I normally go to, like that's when I've been I was used to go to when I was little. But Michael's always used to like y'all, y'all know my backstory, blah blah blah. We built sports, but we didn't really have no money. So when we would go to places like Michael's, I was in there like wow. Cause I used to watch a lot of like charm clay and art videos and they used to have all these supplies and stuff that I thought was so cool. And I couldn't afford none of it. We would go in place like Michael's like every now and then um, with my grandma. And I would be like, wow, like, oh my God, like look at all the stuff and all the art supplies. I was in there. I was really bad, y'all. I was in there like opening stuff cause I knew I couldn't buy it or take it home. So I'm opening the clay, trying to make it in the store. Like, <laughs> It was just a lot. So now that I have my own money, I'm going to go crazy. I'm just playing. But I definitely am about to get some stuff. They moved the store right here. And I think this used to be a, a, a Marshall's. Yeah, this used to be a Marshall's. But I think Home Goods and they have a Ross over here. I don't know. Maybe I should buy some like room stuff. I don't know. Anyways, not, we didn't come here for that. So I'm going to look on TikTok to see like what all I can get you know me I am nobody literally without a list I don't know exactly like I watch videos but I, I don't really know like I feel like I know more in my head about what I want to do I'm gonna need a notebook I'm gonna need some tape or glue I think I'm gonna use tape only because a hot glue gun I don't know if it's gonna like pierce the other side depending on how thick the book is I need some stickers I need some markers do I have markers some like sparkly pens i really think that's it so i have notebook glue stickers markers sparkly pens decorations and that kind of decorations kind of covers everything so i'm gonna go in here right now and hopefully i can get everything before my camera dies and i'm gonna see you guys when i get it guys so we're walking in i want to see i hope they have a lot of stuff and i should have got that buggy over there but it's okay they probably have buggies here and this is a really good store i can't believe they move stores see this is the type of buggy i like y'all know buggies be giving me hell as far as like noises and 
stuff like that goes. But this baby, this is a nice baby. Hold on, let me sit y'all down. So I see canvases, and I'm pretty sure I'm already at the right place because this is like art stuff. Okay, here are all the notebooks and everything. Y'all, this buggy work almost too good. Okay, I'm trying to see what what type of book. Okay, these are like art books. This is a sketchbook. See, this one is cute. It's long ways, and I think I want it to be long ways. They also have like the spiral ones, and maybe I should do a spiral one, and I can also just turn it sideways. I'm gonna look around a little bit more, but I think I'm gonna, I don't know if this is gonna be the end, be the one I end up going with. Though. I wonder if a scrapbook is like an actual thing, like if a, they, there's like scrapbooks, you know? I'm gonna just ask her. Okay, y'all, so apparently they have, they just have like regular scrapbooks. And hold on, I gotta film. I'm trying to film for both. So like, whatever I film here, I gotta film here. I'm gonna try to go down every aisle just because I see a lot of good stuff. These are like markers. Oh, no, these are like colored pencils. I don't need colored pencils. And I think I have a thing of markers at home, if I'm not mistaken. So I might not even get markers, but I do want to get some like sparkly pens. Something that's good for like decorations or whatever. Markers, let's see. I'm trying to see if they have like sparkly ones. Those are cute, but I want them to be sparkly. Or maybe I should just get a thing of Sharpies. Should we do pastel? Like, should I make this page, like, should I make a page pastel? Should I make this whole book pastel, actually? Um, oh, glitter ones. Okay, I'm gonna get these, because they are the glitter pens, and I'm definitely gonna need those. I'm gonna get these pastel ones, too. If I was making, like, a small book, I would get, like, these. You know what I'm saying? Like, if my pictures were small and everything, I would get, like, these, because these are, like, journals, and, you know, you can make a small scrapbook out of that one. Got markers, got pens. Um, I don't what else do I need? I don't know what else I need. Paint? I have paint. I have a lot of paint. So if I wanted to paint on the page and stuff, I have paint and paint brushes for that, I think. But maybe I should get a watercolor set too. A watercolor is this expensive always? $40? Okay, these are $19. It's like a travel size. I think I'm going to get the iridescent ones. I just need a small one for like the decorations on the pages and stuff. I'm going to try to get... Oh, so I'm gonna try to like not only put the pictures on there, but I want it to say something, you know. Like I want them to, I want it to like kind of describe the picture or whatever. Do I need paint brushes? Maybe I should just get some paint brushes just in case. I'm gonna just get these. Now let's see. I need to get stickers. Okay, now we're in the glue aisle, and I think I definitely need because I have a hot glue gun, y'all. It's just a tiny one, and I don't have any sticks for the tiny one. So I'm gonna just get some small sticks for my hot glue gun. We need like tape glue or something. Oh my gosh, this is the aisle that I used to be down. Like I know y'all remember that era where they was all making like them tape them like clay charms and like my charm clay collection and everything like I used to want to be one of them girls so bad like I would have loved I love this aisle when I was younger y'all like look at these stickers they're all kind of childish okay I found the tape I was looking for I think I'm gonna get this one like the little like runner type tape that they be having I also picked up these like little flowers I want to get some tape too I don't know what type of tape y'all but I'm gonna just get a, a bunch of ones not a bunch of them but like maybe I should just get oh and this is the pastel color so I'm definitely gonna get this one this one's so cute so we're gonna get tape for like decorations I think these right here are actual scrapbook scrapbooks I see this one which is the big one um, but it's $25 the pages are really good so I know that I wouldn't have problem with these pages but then I see this scrapbook, which is not the cutest, but I definitely can like do something to the front of it or something. I might have to go with this one because this one's like an actual scrapbook. I don't know, my camera don't fit in 17%. Okay, so I feel like I pretty much got everything that I needed. I ended up going with this one, guys. If I don't like it, then it's fine. I'm gonna just try to decorate the outside like really cute and stuff. But I got this. And then I got this like decoration paper that I can like cut up into like things. I got a picture frame because I want to frame a picture of me and my dad on there. I got some tape, decoration tape. I got this permanent like tape thing. 
of course the watercolor I got the pastel markers some super glue um, these little mini paint brushes I got these sparkly like stardust pens and then I got these glue pens that like look really cute and they're like iridescent kind of pearly so we're about to check out y'all gonna tell me how much y'all think it's gonna be because I think it's gonna be a million dollars but it's okay it's okay because this is like really cute and these are things that I can like reuse like it's not just like a one-time thing like, I keep using them so It's freaking 136, which is not as bad as I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be way, way worse. But I got all this stuff. I'm gonna see you guys when I get the car. Please, we got all of the goods, and it was actually less than I thought it was gonna be. I thought it was gonna be like 200, but it wasn't that much. And I'm so excited to start everything and like use my printer. Hold on, y'all. It's, it's so hot out here. Y'all know what I said earlier about it being like cold and stuff. Uh -uh. I'm gonna go over to Chick-fil-A to get me something to eat because I am starving and then I'm about to head home because for one I know I'm being traffic and two I don't have nothing else to do so I'm gonna get started on making my scrapbook I at least want to get the first few pages done like y'all it's a few things that I know I want in the scrapbook and I don't know if I want to do it like in order or do I want to just kind of like randomly like as I go do it I don't know I'm not gonna stress myself out thinking about that I'm gonna just do it as I when I get there wish I had my digital camera SD card so I can go to Best Buy because it's literally right here and ask them how can I get my videos off now, you know I bought my device and everything so I'm trying to get the videos off of it and I had noticed that like when I connected it to my camera I mean when I connected the SD card to my phone I couldn't see any videos it was just pictures like they didn't even show up so I'm like okay maybe it work on my computer so I tried Try my computer and um are they gonna go try on my computer and they're like not showing up it's like showing up as like an audio file and not like the actual thing so i don't know what's that about i don't know i don't know what's that about so y'all chloe is, me, is pregnant i just got the youtube notification oh my gosh Oh my gosh y'all no wait wait i have to get my food and i have to pull over and watch her video she's pregnant chloe has me do y'all know who chloe has me is the it girl of hygiene literally oh my god she just got pre oh my she just married her fiance i love this for her i love this for her oh my gosh y'all no way look gosh i cannot believe she's pregnant oh my god y'all i've been watching this girl literally since i was like like younger than 12 like you're gonna be such a good mom like you can just tell about how she takes care of herself how she take care of her household how she take care of her family her mother like you can just tell she's gonna be she's gonna be a she's she's gonna be a really good mother and i love that for her like god bless her like seriously like i love this for her I was gonna try to keep this a secret way longer, but your girl's morning sickness is so bad. It's not even morning sickness, it's all day sickness. I have some of the worst morning. I'm so sick. There's no and act like I'm not as sick as I am. So we're just gonna let y'all know right now. We are nine weeks pregnant. Dang. That's a long time. Yes, we are nine weeks pregnant and we are so excited, you guys. And some people, but we tried for our baby and we are so excited. I bought these like little taffy things from Michael, there's no way this is good for you, but it's like coming like this little jelly pen. Mmm. I think I might be losing my mind. But let me head home. I know I'm being traffic. Let me get started. Period. Hi guys, I'm all back at home. I finished eating my what that? What did I have to eat? It's been so long. But y'all, I had some Chick-fil-A. I ate that. That was so good. But I am about to show you guys what I got from Michael's. And I'm also going to start on my scrapbook. I'm definitely going to have to turn this into a series. Because I'm not going to finish the scrapbook all at once. Go through the memories as I'm doing the scrapbooks. If that makes sense. Like, so, let's just get started. 
first thing I got was this little like thing for like paint. Then I got some pastel Sharpies. I got some watercolor, a watercolor set there like iridescent. I got these little pearly glitter pins, like glitter glue pins. It's gonna be so cute. I can't wait to do this, y'all. And I don't wanna just make it like a just cause I'm filming type of thing. Like I actually want to make a scrapbook, like period. I'm probably gonna end up making more than one scrapbook. Anyways, I got these little cute little flowers. I got some Gorilla Super Glue. Hopefully I don't get that on me. Some sparkly pens. I got this like paper because I see on TikTok people like cutting up paper and making it like around the edge of like pictures and stuff like that. I don't know. I'll be watching a, I'll be watching the videos when I'm like bored at, at night. But paint brushes. I got this photo frame that I'm going to if you guys been here since my old room at my mom's house, I had this painting sitting on like those same flowers, but they were yellow. Um I'm gonna put a picture of me and my dad on here. And I got this tape thing, which I'm so excited to use these. I've never used one of these before, but it's like a a tape stick thing. I got some of these stickers, crafting tape to like decorate. I got some hot glue sticks for my hot glue gun. And then my scrapbook. I'm just so excited. Like y'all, I don't y'all don't know how excited I am. I'm really excited. I'm really excited. So this is all the stuff that I got and we're gonna let's just get started. I guess I should start getting my pictures together first. Like what pictures I might want to use. I don't really like the color of this book. I wish they had like a book that was cuter. But the paper in this is really good paper. And I know that it's going to help me as far as like the glue and the hot glue guns and all this other stuff. The first page I'm going to start on, I'm going to make that like baby pictures. Like that's going to be kind of like my introduction to this whole thing. Like baby pictures. Okay, let me get the pictures ready. That way I can get them printed on my printer and then I'm going to be right back. I put all of my pictures, like baby pictures, in a photo album. So here's all of them. If y'all don't know, most of the pictures that I have are with me and Soleil, but I do have some pictures alone. That's kind of like, I think it's me. I don't know, me and Soleil look really alike when we was little, so I don't really know exactly, but I think it's me. Like, over the years, we like, oh yeah, this is Yanni, no, this is Soleil. Okay, well, maybe this was Yanni and it's not really Soleil. But anyway, y'all, this is my printer over there. Again, shout out to Lini for sponsoring today's video. These pictures about to eat and be really cute. So let me print them out and then I'll be back. I just want to tell y'all that I had all of them. <laughs> I'm so excited. Okay, bye. Makes you seem close tonight. Okay, y'all, for real. But we're going to print them out. I'm going to try to see if they have it so I can make them a little bit smaller. Because, y'all, this printer is a 4x6 printer, which is really good for, like, the book itself is really big. So I'm not really worried about it. Plus, some of the pictures I'm going to cut up and everything to, like, fit the page. But I want to try to see if I can make them a little bit smaller, which I think I can. All my pictures printed i think how i want this page to go is like this picture right here and then like my name and like some cute decorations here and then i want this page to be filled with pictures does that make sense okay let's just start off out the back i want to try this little glue gun thing um i'm hoping it works i don't even know how to use it for real but we're just going oh okay wait let's see do i need to cut it should i cut the perimeter off no, because I'm going to put a little cute little tape thing around it. Okay, so let's see. Let me just move these out of the way for now. I'm going to put this right here so it stays down. I hope I'm doing this right. Ooh. Now I just hope it sticks to the, to the paper. Okay, let's see. Y'all look! Yay! 
Okay, so I got that one done. I know I'm gonna need some scissors for these because I tried to make them like as small as possible. I'm gonna just kind of place these like throughout. So let me get some scissors right quick. Okay, y'all, so I have to get more pictures, obviously. I need to go print some more pictures, but let's just work on this page right here. I want this to be full with pictures, so I have to print some more where I can, like, cut out. Maybe put, like, here, here, and there. So, yeah, I'm going to take this tape and do a pink, like, little thing around like the border here, maybe. I want this to be so cute, but I don't really know any, like, ideas. Like, what could I do? I think I would just really do anything, y'all. Like, I want this to be so cute and fun. Um, we, like, doubled them there. Can y'all get this? Let's see. I'm going to use the pens. I got all these colors. These are so cute. I think I'm going to use, okay, the pink one is cute. Let's see, what should I do? Put some hearts. Okay, period. This right here is why I should have been paying attention in school when they was teaching cursive. Because I don't know cursive. Just do Jui, Yanni, Yanka, but I'm, I'm going to outline it in pencil first just in case I mess up. Hey guys, what's up? It's the next day. Today we are going to be continuing on my scrapbook. Y'all know yesterday I went and I started a little bit. This is definitely going to have to be a series because I cannot finish it all in one. But y'all, so we did the little front page. I still have to add some pictures and stuff up here. And I want to add some more decorations on here. But I decided that this scrapbook is not going to be like an in-order scrapbook of like my life. Because it's a lot of like, I don't know. I consider my like younger years one big thing. So these pictures are not like all baby pictures because like i don't have a whole lot of just like baby baby pictures or like yeah i don't really have a whole lot of baby pictures it's definitely not by myself most of them are just me and soleil so i thought why not just like put that as a whole page but i decided for this book which it's not gonna be the last scrapbook i make y'all i'm gonna make each page its own page so like you could skip to the back of the page and it'd be like something that has nothing to do with like the beginning of the page or like something like that whatever but i did want the first page to be the baby pictures because i just feel like that makes sense but i just printed off some more pictures which i'm gonna go down to the pool and do this one because i really feel like i need to be outside and just like th this is like a scrapbook it's really nice outside y'all know i barely go to the pool never go to that pool at all and it's getting colder outside so won't be able to do that for much longer um i just printed off some more pictures can you guys guess what this theme is gonna be this page is gonna be more spread out this is the page where i want to do more like artwork or whatever like more drawings and more doodles on the page and like explaining it blah 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 i just pack my stuff up right now i have everything that i need i just need to get a bottle of water and some napkins for the paint because i want to use my watercolor stick on this page because the theme of this page is like purple and pink 
So I want to do something like cool. Pack my stuff up and then we can go downstairs. I'm still going to take my digital camera so we can like make this a memory. Hey guys, I made it out here. So I have to set up everything like I have my, if I hit 100K, like before I hit 100K, y'all know how I did two photo shoots, like if you don't know, I did two photo shoots, one was like a home type of photo shoot, and then the other one was like my real 100K photo shoot, but I have the Polaroids from that first photo shoot in here, so I'm going to add them to the page, because it's like no use for them just using it. I'm so excited to use, I'm so excited to use these watercolors. I've never used watercolors before other than in like school or something. Okay, I'm going to use these are the pictures I'm going to be using. This is going to be my YouTube slash 100k um, page. So I have like a bunch of different pictures. I'm sorry if you guys hear the water more than you hear me. I'm going to try to like make it so that doesn't happen. But we're going to see. Oh, this is just so cute. Hold on, y'all. I got to take a picture. Oh, cute. I really want to get in the pool, but I do. Okay, that's it. The first step is to cut the pictures how I want them to be cut. Like these right here with like my subscriber count on there. I want them to be cut. Oh, oh no, I cut this one. This one's super cute when my dad made them, um, them newspapers for me. This one got cut kind of off. I don't even know if I'm going to use this one because it doesn't really look right, but we're going to cut it this one too. When I hit 53,000 subscribers, I've really been doing YouTube for so long, and it's just kind of like mind-blowing to me that it's like really 100,000 people watching me. Almost 150,000 people watching me at this point, but either way, it's still crazy, like, who would have ever thought? And I hit 80,000. I'm going to cut these just a little bit. I'm going to cut the edges off of these to give them a cuter look. I just got done with like the basic outline of it. I like how the watercolor paint paint is like way really cute. I don't really know what I'm doing, but I think I'm gonna add these two flowers kind of like over the the hundred K side. Um, I probably should have cut more off of it, but it's okay. So we're gonna add those. The reason I brought my fan, y'all, is so that the super glue can dry fast because the fumes be getting to me. But y'all, I just think this is such a cute little activity. Like this is just so cute. I'm happy I'm doing this, y'all. I've been thinking about doing this for a long time and just never got around to actually doing it. Which is crazy, but now here we are. I can't wait to get more pictures and add more stuff to it, y'all. The next vlog um, is going to be like me actually doing like an activity that goes along with it. I already know what activity I want to do because it's just like last year on my teens, I'm just trying to experience a whole lot of stuff that I've never experienced before. Um, I know it's a lot of stuff that's kind of like, girl, just wait, you're going to be in your 20s, that's going to be lit, but 
I just want to, I don't know, I have some fears to get over. Literally, I have some fears to get over. So, my next video is probably going to be me facing my fears. Um, but it's still like enjoying my last year as a teen. So, I'm going to make this like an episode series. I feel like either way, y'all are going to really like it. And it's going to be so cute because I'm just excited for it. Like, and then, y'all, it's so hot out here. I should have brought my swimsuit. I really want to get in the pool. That's what I might do. I might go upstairs, put this stuff up, come back, get in the pool for a little bit, and then go edit. I gotta edit this video, yeah. See, like, on Pinterest, they have so many cute stuff. Like, I wish I had, like, letters or, like, little envelopes. Um, when I do, like, my travel page, I have a lot of, like, plane tickets and stuff, so that's gonna be really cute, but, yeah. Okay, let me write the date. What day did I hit 100K? I hit it on June 19th, 2023, so I'm gonna write that on here with this um, black marker. My camera keeps overheating, but it's totally been a flex so far. Show y'all. Ah, that's so cute. Okay, next up, I'm gonna take my Polaroid pictures out. I'm gonna show y'all, hold on. Okay, so I wanted to show y'all the Polaroids that I've been keeping. Um, These are from the first photo shoot that I had. They're so cute. Look at them. I forgot I even had a lot of these. A lot of these are like really old, but I had a lot of them. That's a minute. I'm gonna have to go through them. I'm gonna have to go like all of them. I'm gonna have to go through them and see which ones I like and which ones I don't like. Actually, y'all, should I just fill this whole page? Literally, should I fill this whole page up with just color work? And, like, kind of just scatter them everywhere? Of course, I probably can't use all of them, so I still need to go through them. So, I like this one. This one's cute. This one. So, these are the pictures that I'm going to use. I'm going to have to super glue these down because I know that tape thing is not going to work. But I do want to cut this little corner piece out and maybe stick it to like the edge or something. I don't know, I kinda wanna put this in here somehow. this part of it. My 100k page is probably my favorite page so far. I mean, I only have two pages, but it came out so cute. Look at all the like. It looks like it's not coming out. It's really adorable, like. It came out so cute. But, I'm gonna see y'all when I head back upstairs so I can give y'all like a little bit of a rundown, but this is definitely gonna be a series, like I keep saying. I love my scrapbook already. I haven't even decorated the front yet because I want the front to be really cute, and I haven't really found, like, something that I want to do to it because I don't want to just be plain. And y'all, my handwriting is really not the best, so I just gotta work with what I can work with. But I hope you guys like this little outside thing. I'm gonna get in the pool for like two seconds and just put my feet in there because it's really hot outside and I'm gonna see y'all when I get up this quickly. Since we are visible, charging the traffic, I put the kid on the caddy, cutting on paper, that shit on this.